years ago, I did my first Edzoology episode on the Praying Mantis. This is a Praying Mantis. Well, cool. Man, that is embarrassing. Now, I've learned more on this interesting insect, I'd like to share it with you. Praying Mantids are insects. Ouch. She is really pinching into my hand and it's actually breaking the skin. I'm not bleeding, but it's pretty darn annoying. <laughs> now, there are 2,200 species of praying mantis worldwide. They live in temperate and tropical habitats. This is the Carolina praying mantis. Now, it's one of the three different species in the US. The other two are the uh, the European praying mantis and and the Chinese. That the largest is is the Chinese praying mantis. The way the praying mantids got here to America, uh, they actually hid on a shipment of nursery plants to the U.S. And just look at the camouflage. You can see how they could actually hide on a shipment of plants. They were intentionally imported as a pest control source for organic gardeners. What, what they do is they sell the egg sacs. And they're for organic gardeners so that they can avoid using like pesticides and poisons to keep bugs away. And she's laid 11 egg sacs. Depending on the species, between 10 and 400 eggs in each one. Eggs are deposited in a frothy mass, which is produced by glands in the abdomen. The eggs hatch in the spring. There's gonna be about 4,400 little baby mantises that look kind of like small versions of this without wings. Pretty strange. Praying mantids have compound eyes, so they can see several things at once. I can barely see a thing right now. Hello? Anybody in there? They need compound eyes for a reason. They can see in several directions at once. So everything, so if they saw a fly swarm coming towards them, they could see it from several directions and get out of the way. So you can't really sneak up on a praying mantis. Not only do they have compound eyes, on the side of their head, they also have three simple eyes, arranged in a triangle between the two antennae. Plenty of creatures would like to eat a mantis, such as owls, bullfrogs, chameleons, milk snakes. It's a pretty long list of critters that would probably try to eat them. Praying mantids are ambush predators. What they do is they sit there waiting. They just sit there perfectly still waiting for the prey to come too close, and then whammo! They grab them with these two highly evolved front legs, and they kind of grab them and then eat them alive. When they eat, when they're eating their prey, when they're done, they have to clean their two raptorial legs, which is the name for those two front washa. Those two front highly evolved legs. But they have to clean them off, because if they don't, they will die of infection from the bacteria that was on their prey. Cut.